Hey, what's up, y'all? So in today's video, I'll be taking y'all with me on my protein treatment routine on my text likes hair. I know, I know I'm looking busted right now. I know it's a mess, okay? But that's okay. We about to get it together. And I just want to show y'all all the products that I use. I do use the Afro G products. I use their entire line. This is not sponsored. They sent me their products, like the horrific line, like a year or two ago <laughs> and I think they sent me a couple more products and I use them and I've just been really really hooked on their products especially since I went text lax because their products are geared towards chemically treated color treated hair so I love their products I go pick them up at Sally's okay and I just they have done my hair so 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 right so I'm about to show y'all everything I use today a protein treatment is definitely due on this girl girl i still <laughs> have not did a protein treatment on my texas hair so this will be my first time doing a protein treatment on my texas hair so i'm excited to see what that will do when you do have text lax or relaxed hair whatever you should keep up on your protein treatments like every six weeks because once you put that chemical on your hair girl them bonds is broke okay them bonds is just being broke down with that strong harsh chemical so you do have to take some extra steps in order to keep your hair as healthy as possible so i've been slacking I have, like i said i have not done um a protein treatment on my hair since i've been text lags but today i'm gonna get my life okay so before i start i just want to show y'all my hair <laughs> girl it's very greasy um i've had it straightened for over two weeks the first week i was wearing my hair second week i was wearing clip-ins and then the third week i've just been you know putting it up in a sleep ponytail so it's all kinds of edge control and jam up in my hair right now so it's super greasy super desperately need to be washed i just wanted to show y'all my hair too to um get a look at my new growth because whoo y'all can just tell the difference like OMG. I think I got my texturizer sometime in July of this year. So it's been five months since I've gotten a texturizer. That is like my new growth so far. And it is very real. It's very annoying. I ain't gonna lie. I cannot wait to get a touch up. If y'all don't know, I'm just waiting until my pregnancy is over with. I am currently in my sixth month of pregnancy. So I'm just waiting until this pregnancy is over to go ahead and do my touch up just to avoid the whole chemicals while pregnant type of thing. Stretching it for a few more months, but we almost there. I cannot wait to get a touch up. Like I cannot, I cannot wait. wait. Do you hear me? But I'm still hanging in there. I'm still making it work, do what it do. And we about to go ahead and get started. So I'm about to hop in the shower and wash my hair. And I just want to show y'all what I use. Now I use two shampoos occasionally. This is the occasional shampoo, tea tree oil shampoo. It's just a generic brand. I get this from Sally's as well. And it says compared to Paul Mitchell tea tree shampoo. I love the Paul Mitchell tea tree shampoo. I used that for a while with my clients that had dandruff and things like that. So I couldn't find it at Sally's. So I just opted for the generic because the there said that people really seem to like the generic brand and let me tell you it is amazing like it works really really good i'm not gonna use this today because i do not have any flakes i only use this when i notice that my scalp is flaking up but this is definitely my staple shampoo now since i've been text lax and it is the apple g shampoo for damaged hair and it just restores shine it normalizes the ph it is just such a great shampoo for chemically treated hair. So I'm about to hop in the shower, wash my hair. This is the first step of a protein treatment, making sure your hair is deeply cleansed and clean and all of that. So let's go ahead and get into it. I'm back, here's my hair, freshly washed. As you can see, girl, that natural hair. Ooh. Got my hair growing straight back up again. But um, yeah, here's how it's looking. About to go ahead and get started with my protein treatment i'm using the apple g two-step protein treatment and i'm also going to be using a spray bottle to put it in because if y'all have never done a protein treatment then y'all need to know that this junk is messy it stinks okay so <laughs> having it in a spray bottle is definitely definitely a necessity just to keep everything kind of controlled as best as you can i would definitely recommend this mist bottle because it's not like a regular spray bottle y'all know y'all don't caught on with the whole mist bottles that you know it just sprays on the hair very evenly and it leaves less of a mess and stuff like that boom i got my protein treatment in my bottle and i'm dreading this because y'all i just really don't like doing protein treatments like i said they stink okay they messy i just don't like doing them but they really do help your hair so I'm about to suck it up and get stanky <laughs> Of the words themselves, but the platitude is used to explain. 
Raggedy for this today. You know you ain't ready. shirt and all of my pants and then I just ran out on the last section <sighs> hold on I got a little bit more up in here we gonna we gonna try to make this work hold on oh, oh, shoot like this was just the worst this was terrible so um yeah I'm so glad I'm done with this mess this stinking mess and now I'm about to sit under my dryer you want to let it harden you can either use a um, handheld dryer and just blow dry it until it gets hard oh and it's just dripping oh like y'all i hate this so much but you know you let it harden up under the dryer for i think 10 minutes or something like that all right finally done i'm so happy that i'm done with that mess y'all my whole neck is stiff because i got protein oh my god it just feels disgusting protein stuff all on my neck and it's hardened up and it's all stiff all on my neck <laughs> but this is how your hair should look after a protein treatment this is how mine is looking nice and crispy okay <laughs> and mine only took about i say that was like 10 5 to 10 minutes not long at all so i'm about to go ahead and rinse this mess out and i'll be right Whew. all right so the mess is finally out of my hair <laughs> everything is rinsed out as you can see and now i'm about to go in with the balancing moisturizer this is like step two to the protein treatment basically it's just a conditioner to help um get your ph balance back how it's supposed to be and moisturize your hair after all that protein so i'm about to go ahead and put this all over my hair rinsing my hair out here is my hair oh it's feeling so so freaking good oh my god if y'all can feel my hair right now it feels like butter oh oh it just feels so 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 good so pull close up oh yes honey my hair needed that so so bad about to proceed with my silk press for my leave-in i'll be using the apogee leave-in conditioner i love this stuff it protects your hair from heat damage and i can tell y'all that it really does the damn job okay love this stuff it detangles my hair really good i just love it and i'll go ahead and put it into this spray bottle just to make it easy to distribute i made sure this one work this is my designated bottle <laughs> 
for my leave-in conditioner because this is the only leave-in conditioner I use now. Like this stuff is it's my jam, okay? And then I'm also gonna use the um, Keratin and Green Tea Reconstructor by Apogee. I will highly recommend this for color treated and chemically treated hair. Love this stuff. So I got my two leave-ins here and I'm about to go ahead and get started. so good and it's growing so fast if y'all remember I just um, cut my hair maybe it was like up here maybe I cut it into a blunt bob I feel like it's grown back and then some already I think I'm just gonna let it grow I'm not gonna do any more like blunt cuts or anything because I actually miss my layers <laughs> like I liked when my hair was layered because I could you know my little feathers be popping and stuff so I'm definitely gonna be keeping up on my trims I mean some new shirts from Amazon and I'll be using these for the first time over on the part two of this video so that is it for this one this is the final result of my protein treatment I needed that protein treatment so so bad so I'm glad I finally did it my hair is feeling good girl it's looking good it's smelling good all of that <laughs> thank y'all so much for watching again stay tuned for part two of this video and i will catch y'all in the next one